welcome to the semi-finals of Africa's Business Heroes 2024. We're here in Egypt at the heart of Africa's entrepreneurial future. We have so many countries and one of the things that we're so excited about is our diversity. After six years of hosting a competition in different parts of Africa, east, west, south, it was finally time for us to come to North Africa. Egypt is um, a very interesting country and we have several amazing finalists from Egypt who are part of the competition and so we thought it would be good to come to celebrate our Egyptian community and to also strengthen the bonds between Sub-Saharan Africa and North Africa. Cairo is a great destination for entrepreneurs. The weather is great, we're in the Nile. Everyone is seriously so happy right now. Inspiring pitches, bold ideas, and the drive to make an impact. This is what defines Africa's business hero. Water is a global issue. We've helped create indirectly over 2,000 jobs. We are building Africa's first financial services that unleashes the full potential of small business owners. I created Saina, merging education and digital employment for my generation and beyond. With Lakinois, we changed the way Africa owns the coffee business. We are skilled to market education platforms that provide skills for the jobs you need today for just one dollar a day. Three main questions that they should be able to respond. One is, do they have grit? Do they have determination? And they won't give up, because that's what makes the whole difference. The second one is, are they really solving a problem? Is there a need in the market? Are they authentic and unique? After working in community pharmacy practice for over four years, I quickly realized that pharmacies are usually the first point of call for Nigerians. And the last one, I think, is, do they have the right team? There's an amazing team behind me. Together, we have over 30 years combined experience in logistics. And if yes, yeah, then it totally makes sense to have them on board. The most interesting thing about this competition is it's really pan-Africa. You're starting to see founders from all over the whole African continent this year, from Egypt, from Nigeria, from even Madagascar, I think, this year. And just the broad sense of the types of companies. It's not just one sector, one segment. It's open to all the different types of companies, so that's always really interesting. Get as much help as possible. You know, be as open uh, as possible network and be willing to listen to advice that challenges your very assumptions about the very business that you're in. And how sustainable do you think 17% is a take rate on insurance premiums? You're spending a million dollars on people. You need to cut that down as much as possible to get yourself to break even as much as possible with your current business side. It's my first year here. So I was quite excited to come because I'm someone who fully believes in entrepreneurship, in empowerment, especially in women empowerment. And it's exciting because most of the women I have seen today have brilliant ideas. We decided to create a company that not only empowers farmers in Africa using African grown raw materials, but we would train them, create access to funds, finance, digitize the farmer network. This has been an amazing experience for me. So the network that it comes with, for me, has been you know, phenomenal. Regardless of the outcome, I still feel like a hero, like I made it this far. Behind every great event is a team of sponsors and partners committed to creating a platform for growth. We work with local agencies. So in Egypt, we worked with Career 180. We've also been supported by other partners such as Rise Up, which has been a legacy partner, um, an organization that has partnered with ABH since the very beginning. Our main vision is to empower youth and entrepreneurs as well. So organizing a very impactful mega events in the region is our mission. Our mission is to create 2 million jobs for African youth in the next 7 to 10 years. This is why we focus on entrepreneurs. As the semi-finals comes to a close, we celebrate the perseverance, the passion and the power of these incredible entrepreneurs. You are the ABH. 2024 finalists! You are going to the finals in Kigali, December 3rd to December 5th in Rwanda. The efforts of trying again have not gone down the drain. It's been all worth it. I'm feeling so excited, so happy, and I'm over the moon. <laughs> and you indeed are the ones Africa is looking towards and the ones that are going to build the continent of Africa.